Hey what is up guys welcome back to another Minecraft Java video. Today we're going to take a look at how to increase your FPS performance in Minecraft Java Edition. I am on the latest version of Minecraft Java Edition as you guys can see on the top left of my screen there I am running the latest version 1.18.1 but this process should be possible on previous versions so you can use this on version 1.16.5 for example or even 1.17.1 and you should also be able to use this in the upcoming versions for example 1.19 as well so i'm going to show you guys how to boost your fps in your game by changing a few settings and this is going to be a settings change in the options menu and you don't need to have any mods for this you can use this on the vanilla game as well and hopefully your fps should increase after you change the setting all right so let's go into first person mode all right so as you guys can see i am in first person mode and my fps is hovering somewhere between 60 to 70 fps as you guys can see on the fps count on the top left there of my screen if i go into my options click on video settings you can see that i have actually gone ahead and turned everything to the maximum possible value so i've changed the render distance i've put down 32 chunks i've changed the graphic settings here and i've tried to put everything else that i could have seen on this video settings menu and try to set it to the maximum possible value that i could have done so it can put a proper stress on my system and if we go and have a look at the options you can see that my fov is actually set to normal so with the FOV set to normal, I am actually able to get somewhere between 60 to 70 FPS. Now, the setting we are actually going to talk about today is the FOV. So if I go back into options, if we look at the FOV setting over here, we do have this slider. And one thing I have noticed is that if you actually have a lower FOV, you will actually get more FPS in your Minecraft game. Now, some of you might already know this, but for those of you who don't, then you should go ahead and try this, especially if you are on a low end machine or you're not getting as good fps performance in your minecraft game all right so let's go ahead and actually turn this slider all the way down and let's take a look at some of the fps that we would get with the fov turned to 30 like so so as you guys can see my fps has now jumped from 60 to 170 so the fps has actually gone up now normally you would not play with this fov because everything is really zoomed in so you would only possibly use this to zoom into places but not actually play the game with this if we actually turn the FOV all the way to the maximum, so as you guys can see, this is the Quake Pro setting. Now let me go back inside the game. You can now see that my FPS has actually dipped down to the 40. So I'm getting somewhere between 40 to 50 FPS, whereas before I was getting 60 to 70 FPS. Now if you guys are playing on the normal FOV setting, so for example, if we set this to 70, which is the normal FOV value, and you guys are getting low FPS, I would recommend you actually tone down this slider and you take it to the left side and put it somewhere where you are comfortable with playing now you can actually set this to 60 and see how much fps you are getting we can actually go ahead and actually take it down to 57 in my opinion you can still play the game with this setting and still be able to enjoy more fps so as you guys can see i am getting now 80 fps compared to the 60 fps which i was getting previously so if you guys are on a low end machine and you're not getting a playable fps value for example you're not able to hit that 30 fps mark or that 60 fps mark and you are 10 levels behind there so i would recommend that you guys actually go into your options and tone down your fov and give your fps a slight boost as you guys have seen if you guys do like to play on higher fov values then unfortunately that will actually have a negative impact on your fps and it can actually cause your fps to dip even more and this would affect the low end machines in particular so if you guys are on a low end pc or a low end laptop then i would highly recommend that that you guys actually look into your fov and change it from normal to a slightly lower value as you guys can see over here so in my test over here i have found that 57 should be fairly playable it's not zoomed in too much and you should be able to enjoy a higher fps count with the value of 57 
you can also set it to 60 and see how much fps you guys are getting with that figure i would not recommend actually going anything below 50 otherwise you will actually find yourself zoomed in too much and the game might not be that playable as you guys can see right now by lowering the fov from the normal value which is 70 and taking it down to somewhere like 60 or 57 and see how much fps you can get in your minecraft java game hopefully you guys have enjoyed this video and hopefully this will allow you to get more fps in your minecraft java game if you have any comments or queries about this method do leave them in the comment section below and do let me know what kind of fps gains you were able to get by setting a lower fov value in your minecraft java game please also do subscribe to this channel to help support it help it grow and i'll see you guys next time thank you for watching